Evening everyone, so time for another video. Um, what we're going to do here is we're going to actually kick off a new series um, because Fortinet have finally listened and they have started to integrate Azure Active Directory into some of their products. So what I've got here is I've got 40 Client EMS um, on 40 Cloud. Um, and I'm going to build the connection between that and Azure Active Directory. And then in the next video, I'm going to look at the some of the Fortinet single sign-on capabilities using the SSO Mobility Agent um, around how um, it's able to take the user that you're logging into using Azure Active Directory via metadata and get it into your logs. So um, something that's super new with Fortinet um, and a lot of our clients are asking for this type of integration. So I'm gonna uh, go over it during these next few videos. So what we're going to do now is we're going to do the Azure side. Um, so as per the guide, log into the Azure portal, browse, browse to Azure Active Directory. Then we go to Enterprise Applications. We click New Application. We create, create your own application. So I'm just going to call this 40 Client EMS Integration. And we I believe that we need to select the one that says an app that we uh, develop it. So create that. Name's fine. So look for this port account types. Okay, so now that we've created that, we now need to go back to the Azure Active Directory, click on app registrations and then click on the 40 client EMS integration that we just created. Now we need to select uh, OPI permissions, Microsoft Graph. And we need to give, set the following permissions. So So that's um, been added in as per this guide. So we need to add in a client string and determine its value. So on the left menu, click app registrations. Yeah. Certificates and secrets. Okay, new secret. And we need to get a copy of the value, so value equals this and secret ID equals. We won't show that on street, we won't show that on video. Okay. I need to go over to the EMS side, Administration Authentication Service. So, Azure. Okay, so now that we've done that, let's um, test it. We can see success go through there, and we can see that it has been added to the tenancy. Okay, so back into. 40 cloud EMS. Now, if I go to endpoints, manage domains, add Azure, magic, sync every 60 minutes is fine. Import, and uh, we just want to import everything. Yeah. 
I don't think there's much in there to honestly give, so let's see what this does. Have three users, size this. You can see that the Azure AD domain has been added, and you can see there's a group here called Fortigate Access. What I want to do here is as part of um, the Azure Active Directory tenancy, I'm just going to add a new group. So we're just going to call it security, I'm just going to call it 40 B1 test. So we're just going to um, create a new group. See that, so we probably need to sync again. Yeah, so sync in. Yeah, and there we are 40 bytes group. Uh, don't have any endpoints or anything like that tagged. So, um, yeah, let's leave the video at that and we can do the um, single sign on mobility agent.